assalamu alaikum today we are going to start worksheet number 3 number pattern book 4a chapter number 1 page number 11 so first you have to write your name your class and date after writing name class and date date then you are going to start solving the worksheet so number 1 is fill in the blanks here you have to fill in the blanks 10 more than 3799 10 more it means you have to add 10 in the given number 3799 plus 10 we always write from ones tens hundred and thousand so this is from one side okay so you are going to add 9 plus 0 9 9 1 10 ten. so zero is here one on the next number 7 plus 1 8 and 3000 as it is so as you can see 3809 3809 three again you have to add Hundred more in three thousand eight hundred and eighty-three. So it means you have to add hundred in the given number. Then you are going to add thousand in the given number. Now move on to the less. Ten less than four thousand seven hundred and eighty-nine is. Less means you have to minus or subtract the number. Four thousand seven hundred and eighty-nine minus ten. Nine minus zero nine. Eight minus one seven, seven and four, four thousand seven hundred and seventy-nine. So ten minus four thousand seven hundred eighty-nine is four thousand seven hundred and seventy-nine. So you have to solve this with the same method: addition and subtraction. More is for addition, and less is for subtraction. Now fill in the missing numbers. Here you can see we have the missing numbers with the number pattern of plus hundred. So you are going to, going to follow the number pattern of plus hundred. So five thousand five hundred and fifty, five thousand six hundred and fifty, five thousand seven hundred and fifty. How we are going to find this? Five thousand seven fifty. We are moving back with minus hundred. If we minus the hundred from seven fifty, we have six fifty, and if we minus the hundred from six fifty, we have five fifty. So this is the method of number pattern. If you are doing the number pattern from the right side to the left side, you are going to subtract the number, and if you are going to Solve from the left side to the right side. Then you are going to add the number. As you can see, the arrow, the sign of arrow. This, if we are going from this side, we are using the add, and if we are moving from this side, we are using the subtraction. Same as it is. Again, you are going to follow the number pattern with minus thousand. It means you are going to follow from this side. Now, we have page number twelve, which is again. More and less. For the more, we are going to use the addition, and for less, we are going to use the subtraction. Complete the number pattern again. You have to find out the number difference between. Like you have find the difference that here is the difference between the number is hundred, here is thousand. Same as it is, you have find out the number difference between them, and then solve this number pattern. Page number thirteen, worksheet four A. Now you have to again write your name, class, and date. In this worksheet, you are going to solve the rounding numbers. So first, we have to understand that what is rounding means. Rounding number means rounding off number means keeping a simpler value closer to the exact number. Means whatever the exact number is. You, Your rounding number will be closer to the exact number. Example is when rounding to the nearest ten. Nearest ten. It means you are going to follow this nearest ten. So the number seven thousand nine hundred ninety six become eight thousand, and this is the symbol of round off. Now move on to the worksheet. 
here you can see round each number to the nearest 10 you have to round off to the nearest 10 use the number line to find the answers you are going to use this number line to find your answer 44 is between dash and dash 44 as you can see the number line is starting from 30 till 50 30 40 50 and there is a gap between the numbers is 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so there is a gap between 10 numbers in each round off so 44 is between 44 is between 40 and 50 as you can see 40 and 50 44 is nearer to dash than dash 44 is nearer to this is the center 5 so 44 is nearer to 40 or 50 as we can see that 44 is nearest to 40 44 is nearest to 40 then 50 so the round of 44 is 40 again we are going to follow the number pattern method 1000 then 1020 so the gap between is 1001 1002 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 1015 then 16 17 18 19 and 20 so you can see the gap between the numbers is with the 10 digit 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 now 1600 is between now you have to find out that 1600 is between you can see it is between 1000 and 1010 1600 is nearer to 1600 is near to this or this now the gap between is 5 so you can see 1600 is near to 1010 then 1000 1600 round off is 1010 so this is the method of rounding of the number same as it is you have to follow this method now move to the next which is round off with 100 here we are doing round off with tens now we are moving to round off with 100 worksheet 4b again write your name class and date round each given number to the nearest 100 use the number line to find the answer here you are going to use the number line to find the answer and in this worksheet you are going to round off the number with 100 645 is between 645 is between 600 and 700 645 is near 645 is near to 600 then 700 and the round of 645 is obviously the number which is near the exact number is the round off so 645 is nearer to 600 so the round off is 600 same as it is you are going to follow the pattern so this is your today's working thank you so much